All right, y'all, so back again. Finally got this Grom updated, uh, had an update. Last video I talked about not having access to the Google Apps. Well, it looks like this little icon right here that says install G Apps. The way that they have this written makes it sound like you're about to do something extremely bad to the unit. It says there are no G Apps installed. Many VLAN functions will not work. Installation will take around five minutes. Would you like to proceed? And then if I hit yes, look at this message. It says this cannot be undone. This is not something you'd actually want to hit yes on. But apparently, this is what I believe will get me back the Play Store. So, let's go right ahead and install that. And see if we can't get the Play Store back up and running again. Alright, so the system is restarting after it's about to install the G apps onto the unit. So now the system is installing all the Google apps onto the unit. You can see there, everything is being installed. It may take a little while to get this done here, but hopefully after this, we should be able to add the Play Store back into the menu. Which I definitely think is one of the core features of this in-dash unit. So let's see if we get that functionality back as the system boots up here. Alright, so here's the screen at startup. I hit this button here. Alright, so I believe we are back in business. We are back in business, baby. There it is. The Play Store is back. There it is. So we just got to get on Wi-Fi. So this is how you get... Uh, this is how you get the Google Store back on your uh, unit if you did the update like me and it disappeared you've got to do the install G apps off the menu it'll put back those Google apps back on here and you'll be good to go so hope this uh, this little video helps somebody out all right see you guys next time